The Miami Dolphins were knocked out of the knockout round and it was never easy, but they played hard and won mentally. I know winning mentally doesn't mean anything and no matter how you look at it, the Dolphins' season is over, but looking at what we've done on the field, let's be proud of it. While they fought pretty well, quarterback Skylar Thompson and the Miami Dolphins lost to the Buffalo Bills. Thompson did not take responsibility for himself and blamed head coach Mike McDaniels. I blamed our coach for some bad games and put our rookie quarterback in difficult situations. The last stop in the third quarter, for example. Our coach should have played it safe and then hit the ball. That's a big swing. But in the end we lost three people. McDaniels needs to give play calling to offensive coordinator, Thompson said after the game, he was a fool not to know that there was a game clock in the NFL. Is this the reason the Dolphins lost? According to a source, in the Dolphins' dressing room after the game there were conflicts between Mike McDaniels and Skylar Thompson, one of the two was injured, we don't know who it is yet, McDaney also attributed the fault to Thompson. He said, I've never seen a quarterback forget the game clock. Can't even recognize open receiver, 18-45 complete, two interceptions and a quarterback rating of 45 for Thompson, it's funny when the media says Skylar Thompson is better than Tua Tagovailoa. The haters of Tua know nothing about football, yet thousands of fans want Thompson to replace Tua Tagovailoa. McDaniels is regretting not being able to keep Tua healthy. McDaniels' belief in Thompson was completely wrong. Without Tassel we can't win against the Bills, Thompson's bad stats prove it. Thompson's disrespectful words to McDaniels after the game would kill his career. After all it seems that McDaniels still believes in Tua Tagovailoa but he is not really healthy, which is Tua's biggest weakness. Fixing that is very difficult or the Dolphins will bring on another quarterback.